I have large, shapely nipples. I have ever since I was born. You never underestimate these look like this guy, bro. This guy got like that. I don't know that strong alien vibe. From the sixth universe. Oh, Goku's versing Winnie the Pooh. Okay. Shout out to that rock doggo for becoming a Pirate King supporter. Thank you. Percent of you are still not subscribed. Did you ignore Kakarot? Go subscribe now. Hey, you guys heard it from him. That wasn't me. Like, he's telling you guys. I, I think it's like, he's giving you advice. He's a good fighter and everything. Listen to him. Why not? That's Vegeta, bro. Anyways, last episode, they were talking a lot about this Monaka guy, whoever he is. Or she. Nah, they said he, right? I guess there was another mortal that also rivaled Beerus and performed better than Goku. Damn, bro. Who is this guy? He's gonna be on Goku's team, though, so he's not gonna fight Goku, but I really want it. Like, if he's so OP, I want Goku to face up against him. Maybe a sparring match or something. That's not only it, though. That's just one person that we got to find out about. We also got Champa's whole team. So that's a lot of competition for Goku and Vegeta. Pretty sure I remember Champa mentioning there's Saiyans in his universe as well. But yeah, Goku with Super Saiyan Blue, every like everything that we've been mind blown, that was all happening in one universe and another universe. Who knows what the history is? There's a lot of strong people. Let's jump right into episode 31 of Dragon Ball Super. Why do I always have to be in such high demand? This guy is really busy. Like his life. <laughs> But at the time it'll take me to get there. They keep ordering him to do stuff. He just needs a break. Oh man. I've been focusing as hard as I can and I still can't sense Supreme Kai's energy to lock onto. Maybe he's taking a nap or something. Where oh, is Supreme Kai? We haven't seen him in a while. Uh, you hear that? I can't rely on the Kai's or the Saiyans to get there. So it has to be you, Jocko. I'm not some kind of galactic bus driver, Boma. Come on, bro. Just help us Jordan. out. You heard Help them out. too far away, even for them. Not like I didn't warn her. I said calling this little space cop would be a waste of time. <laughs> space cop. Hmm. How dare you? I'm leaving. <gasps> Nobody asked you, Vegeta. No apologize. Oh, no. Come on. Don't you want to help your dear old friend? I can't alter Jacko, don't be like that. But you're brave and smart and wise. I'm sure you can think of something. Oh, that's true. You know your tribe He's might actually now. work on me, Bulma, if only you were 10 to 15 years younger. <laughs> no! Oh my god, I can't believe you just risked it all of saying that. Jerk. <laughs> Bro, look how hard she punched him into the floor. Wait a minute. There's a strange planet not far from here with a guy who might be able to help. His name's Master Zuno. That's a planet? He knows everything. Master Zuno? Is he some kind of wise man? Oh, yeah. He's wise, all right. He can take one look at a total stranger and tell him what patterns on their underwear. <laughs> oh, that is very wise. Master he's Zuno. All knowing he's bound to know something about the Super Dragon Balls. All right, we gotta pay him a visit. <laughs> Fake it's only way. Guess we're flying through space in code. If you're gonna be mean, you can get out. <laughs> She's been they just roasting a spaceship. Settings. Put some music on. Hey, you're not the boss of me. Yo, jackass. Yeah, what is it? <laughs> Don't you try any funny <laughs> business with my wife. Uh, eh? It fits more because his name is Jacko, and then he's like, yo, jackass. I see why Jacko wants to avoid them. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. Take care of Earth while I'm gone. Alright, there goes Bulma. Visiting Zuno. Why does Zuno not know anything about this? Boy, we sure got they just go for no reason. Women, don't we? It's rough. Well, some of the time. To be honest, I like her feistiness. I hear you, Vegeta. That's oh. the same reason I'm with Chi Chi, too. We're wired that way, didn't you know? Saiyans only like strong women. Uh, Is that actually like a genetic that's thing? That's it. That explains everything. <laughs> now there are super Yo. Six Bro, okay, now we know the type. I'm just trying to see the fight so one? bad, you man. I hope. Your girlfriend so I can meet her. Oh, he is it. What's up? Oh, don't tell me. Did they she break up? She dumped your butt, didn't she? She didn't dump me. She let me go. We really have known each other a long time. When huh? did they first meet? What the? That's my shit. Oh, how old is this? Cool, I figured it out. What the hell? You first met her when she was like a toddler? Oh, they go way back. Yeah. Sister's a genius. I say, stealing my stuff. 
With her brain, she's gonna accomplish whatever she wants. And she's totally fearless. I don't know if this is part of Dragon Ball Super only, or was this part of OG DB? age a little bit. I remember thinking that with your smarts, attitude, and piloting skills, you might even become a member of the Galactic Patrol. While I do appreciate the tribute, because you are male, I would only allow you to ask one question. Yes, sir. Okay, so females ask more questions? He knows. Oh, wise master, can you please look at the Earth Woman behind me and tell us her chest measurement? Her bust is 83.4 centimeters around. They used to measure at 87 centimeters, but in her advancing age, they began to oh, this guy is pro for the human female. Yo, what? <laughs> what did I tell you? Lord Zuno's always right. And now with the older out of everything, he tested out with that. Just care to ask the great master Zuno a question of her own? Uh, well, yeah, I would, obviously. I mean, it's the whole reason we came here. Then come up and pay him your tribute. <laughs> you gotta do it. What kind of rules are these? Super Dragon Balls are called Wish Orbs. They were created in the year 41 of the Divine Calendar by the Dragon God Zalama, and they are perfectly spherical, planet-sized celestial whoa, objects. Whoa, whoa, we got a lot of info Balls about the Dragon Balls, like, history. Cosmic artifacts. Super Dragon Balls are called Wish Orbs. Wish Orbs. They were created in the year 41 of the Divine Calendar by the Dragon God Zalama, and they are Zalama, perfectly Dragon spherical, planet-sized celestial objects, measuring exactly 37,100 96 point two two zero four kilometers in diameter okay Super Dragon I guess why their head is so big they have all this seven. information they stored divided between the sixth and seventh <gasps> universes to the mortal eye they will appear as pale yellow spheres in the center of each is a unique arrangement of red star-shaped markings numbering them one through seven these red marks refract Wait, light so that they appear sec. as stars from <laughs> she's seeing our notes I question look who's talking you wasted two of your three your brain's getting as saggy as your boobs what the hell is going on? Bro, it's been going on all episode. Oh my god. Why is he just. This, reminds me, I need to this guy doesn't hold back at all. Visit as soon as possible. Master Zuno's head is really that big? Course, <laughs> That's the first thing he tells him. Than that. When Boma got her turn, she burned her first question. It was sad. Whatever. At least now we know there are only seven Super Dragon Balls divided between our two universes, so my canceling out plan won't work. Okay, so Jump they got all of them, so there's one left, either in universe six or seven. Universe for a while now to steal the ones we had. Yeah, I thought of that too. Lord Beerus is gonna have a meltdown when he finds out. Right. Oh, Mr. Popo and Dende? <laughs> they got a tennis court up here? Oh, whoa, that was a sick transition. Look at the training they're getting ready for. Okay, they just picked up hell on the beginning of this new episode. Oh, they're in the, they're in the hyperbolic well, time you chamber. Make it easy on me. Every time we fight, you find flaws I didn't know I had. So, this Manaka guy. What do you think he's like? <laughs> what? That guy Beerus picked. I'm just wondering what makes him the toughest opponent Beerus has ever faced. This obsession Can't wait to of meet yours him. is pointless. Focus on the team you'll be fighting. But I can't help it. We know the sixth universe has strong fighters, but we don't know how strong they really are. If Beerus expected a cakewalk, he would have just relied on us. The fact that he didn't is all you need to know. That means oh, they're yeah, very right. strong, yeah. You sure are a genius, Vegeta. Compared to you, I am. <laughs> Vegeta so isn't too smart, it's just awesome Goku's dumb. Including Manaka for us to face. Man, I am super duper pumped up! You sound like a child. Can't you act your age for once? I am acting my age. You said six to fight until we're about 80, right? Right? I don't mean your body, I mean your brain. Uh we're not here to chat. Let's get back to work. You got it. That's what Goku's been Good wanting. Hey everyone. Are we all ready to go? Oh wait, are those Okay, so these are the people that are gonna watch Excellent. the fight. We'll begin transportation to the tournament venue shortly. Damn, this is exciting. I wish I was here. I want to sit next to Master Roshi and we just chill and talk and we'll watch the fights. Oh, sweet! Where's the door? Is this thing really a spaceship? I don't see any engine. No, not a spaceship, a hexahedron. And you board it like so. A what? Okay. There, you see? It's simple. Just step through and the smart wall will allow you to pass. Oh. 
first leg of our flight will be to Lord Beerus's world. We'll meet up with my lord and Monaka and continue Boy, this to sounds like a fun field trip. Time will be approximately three hours. While our final destination will have facilities, this vessel and Even Chi Chi's excited, bro. Can use the restroom before boarding. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I don't see our Saiyans. They realize they have to be there to fight, don't they? I've given up trying to care. <laughs> They're still training. I've from them since they flew off to train in the time chamber. There oh, there you they are. are. Sorry, you really lose track of time in there, seeing as how it's a hyperbolic time Wait, chamber what? <laughs> you know how it is. But What's that? Yo, they just... Uh, we're not going to you Look how these in there. men well, came exactly up, bro. The highest form of respect. <laughs> they come out with full beards and their clothes are ripped up looking like cavemen. <laughs> Sorry, his really toes sticking out of his shoe. <laughs> how it's a hyperbolic time chamber and all. Bro. <laughs> you know how it is. But we stayed an extra week. We trained a ton. Oh. Oh. We're not going till you shower. There's no way I'm sharing that box with your stick. <laughs> <laughs> they gotta get new fresh of clothes, shower. Thanks for waiting, like, guys. what just happened? I kind of forgot what a shower feels like. Oh, they just have a pair of the same exact clothes. Glad you're refreshed. So, is everyone here? Wait for me! Huh? Krillin, where oh, are you Krillin. Been? Tacos. So are you summoning the dragon? Uh, Goku! You don't have to tell the whole planet! All right, all right, nothing to see here. That does it, Weiss. We're all here. <laughs> Wonderful. Here we go. All right, we're dipping. We're going to the tournament, bro. This is lit. Our oh, first was summoned by Beerus, right? I'm excited to see the opponents. What is this place? This is so cool. <laughs> what do you Goten, smell? Do you smell something rotten? Is it yeah, boo? Big time. <laughs> Sticky. I guess in space you can't open a window, right? Oh, that's so true. <laughs> Smells to me like Majin Boo just made a Majin Poo. <laughs> Man, these guys can't take a joke. Good one, Mr. Sane. Hello, scrapbook. <laughs> You're welcome to take pictures. It legit Jordan, feels like a field trip to like a museum, not even like now. a fighting tournament. My lord does value his privacy here. Huh? Oh, who's behind Beerus? That's him? Damn, he's short as hell. Hey, Is that look, Vegeta, that's gotta be him. The strongest mortal Beerus knows. That's the strongest mortal Oh that look the looks are disappointing, not gonna lie. It doesn't look that impressive to me. Yeah, well, let's not underestimate him just yet. And He's probably, know, like, right? broken strong, but You're he looks late. bad. Apologies for that, my lord, but between the showers and the defecation, we just couldn't get moving. Hmm. Is that actually him? Uh, so you're Manaka, aren't you? The fifth member of our team. Please tell me this, I am. Well, we've been oh, hearing that a lot is about him. you, man. Good to meet you. My name is Goku. Okay. You are speaking to the most important weapon we have. Considering your utter lack of tact, you should talk Bro. to him as little as you can. I was asking Whis what he could tell me about you, and he said <laughs> oh, you're the great Pontus on your world. Is that right? Yes, pronunciation aside. It sounded interesting, but I don't know what Pontus are. Does that mean strength or something? It I... means nipples. <laughs> Bro, I didn't expect... So this is the strong... I have large, shapely nipples. I have ever since I was born. Who is it? Why? Who are you? So this guy is the strong. This guy rivaled Beerus. Like this guy is a fighter. This, him right here. Hey, I, I'm not gonna underestimate him. We'll see. Let's see how he you fights. But say. it's disappointing so <laughs> far. I guess. <laughs> and this is why I don't want you to talk. You got it. Even up close, he still doesn't look that strong, does he? Not at all. I am very confused. Hey. What do you say? <laughs> you real quick, nothing big. Just I was confused as Vegeta. Oh, oh. Did I not already tell you to save your energy for your actual opponents? Okay, okay, Lord Beerus, I'm sorry. <sighs> Let's go. Uh, this dude just looks goofy as hell. <laughs> he just had to do it. <laughs> Oh my god! Did he tank it? Bro, look at this dude, it's like a drug. He couldn't hold it back. He's like, I have to fight. I don't blame him too. Thank god he hit him. I wanna see, like, is this guy actually a fighter? 
<laughs> it's just funny how much Goku is like, he has an urge. Compare him to Vegeta. Vegeta is fine with like just walking away, but Goku just had to. Oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, no. What if... It, oh, shoot. This dude is crying. <laughs> Oh, I can't, bro. What just happened? Wait, is this even the right guy? <laughs> he hit him hard as hell. Oh, no, no, no. Beerus is gonna be pissed. Something is different. Bro, that one actually hurt him. Poor guy. <laughs> just how much brain damage do you have? Well, I didn't mean to hit him. I just wanted to see his reflexes and I figured he'd duck. I'm so sorry, dude. I didn't mean anything by it, I swear. This guy looks too weak. Fine. Don't worry about it, dude. Bro, I feel so bad. Oh my god, this is so disappointing. What? Are you guys, were you guys trolling me in the comments? I swear I was reading comments like, yeah, I can't wait till him to meet Manan, Man, what Man, 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 you guys were waiting for me to meet him like it's gonna be a cool thing and seeing him fight. This dude didn't even dodge, he couldn't even... Oh, he started crying, yeah, poor guy, he's I not a fighter. A grill, Chi -Chi. Well, Goku didn't give me the space picnic he promised, so I'm making one myself. Here, Vegeta. Okay, that looks... The, the food in Dragon Ball just looks too years. fire. I apologize on what you're about to witness. <laughs> he's apologizing. <laughs> Actually, maybe that guy didn't start crying. Maybe he just looks so. Oh my god, I can't. No, thank you. I can't eat that sort of organism. <laughs> Watching what you eat to stay healthy, huh? That's impressive, man. I couldn't live without. I can't get over how weird this guy is. Just a few Did he actually dances. rival Beerus? Voila. His eyes started watering when he got hit. Alright, we've arrived to the arena or planet. So they really exist, huh? I wanna see the dra how the dragon looks when you get all of them. The like the super dragon or whatever. Can you land on them? Are they gonna land on the dragon ball? They were as big as planets. I thought you were exaggerating. That's what I was really saying are. too, Bulma. I, mean, I swear. Live on these Said that last episode. Yeah, imagine the power. No wonder you could wish for anything. I think that's more than enough sightseeing. Please, let's go. Understood, my lord. There we go. Oh, yeah. Seems like a lot of trouble for a tournament they'll only hold once. I'm Poor so high for this. A few days. Did he build all this stuff himself? No, Where's Champa's opponents though? They didn't show anything. up at all yet. And even if we did, my brother would never be capable Our of this. Our uh, teammates. It would just be paper and sticks. I heard that, Beerus. <laughs> Wanna say that to my face? I don't think he'd mind. So that's Champa? Yes, the destroyer of the sixth universe. Honestly, I'm shocked you didn't back out. Of course I came, Champa. As if I'd miss the opportunity to see your face when you lose and take your precious rock collection for myself. Glad you're confident. It'll make taking Earth much more fun. By the way, I know about your dirty little secret, Champa. You stole some of those orbs from my universe, which explains your trespassing. What are you talking about? We know there are only seven of them you spread across bro. two universes, 4K. so that means you must have taken some of ours. <gasps> Who told you that? I knew you were up to something. Wait! I did no such thing! If you weren't my twin brother, I'd destroy you for such a theft. Not that it matters, they'll all be mine soon anyway. You should be using this time preparing for inevitable failure. Are you two done yet? If so, then I can escort you all to the arena now. As you can see, we have ample seating for everyone. Are those seats made out of rock? Ugh, don't you have cushions or something? <laughs> Trunks is right. We came a long way for this so you could at least make those it Those are some uncomfy-ass seats. Come, Earthling. 
I think she has a point, Champa. What kind of host allows their Bro, guests to sit in such a cut-rate seat? Bro, they did all this. Just add some cushions. Seat? Honestly, I'd be humiliated if I were the one responsible. You'll take that back! Whis. Yes, my lord. Oh, Whis will add the cushions. I always okay. do enjoy redecorating. Now, let's see. Oh, he's erasing and restarting their work. Okay. Oh, that's luxury. There we go. You're making me look bad. Why didn't you make it fancy? <laughs> I know you can do better than stone bleachers. Sir, it would be disrespectful for an artist to create a work of art her patron would not appreciate or understand. <gasps> that's my older sister for you. Yes, she was just trying to operate on your level. She just you dissed him so hard. For being so well used, Bro, Jump was just getting flamed by everyone. Boys, do your best. Okay. Hello, Goku. Huh? Oh! It's been far too long. Hey! Yo, you what's up, guys? No bodies again, but I thought once you fused together, you couldn't go back. That's normally true, and as much as we hate relying on their power, we asked the Namekians to separate us using their Dragon Balls. We tried to make do, but after a while, we just couldn't. Be okay, so they're here for the tournament as well. Your energy. I was still looking for the two of you together. What's up, Kabito? It's good to see you again. Good to see you too, Goku. When we heard about these matches, we couldn't resist. And how are you, old timer? Staying busy? Oh, you bet. Mostly just watching Beetle wrestling and keeping up with my favorite magazine. Beetle you know, wrestling, I really bro. Had an aneurysm watching your battle with Beerus. Who is that? Who are those hey guys? What's up? <sighs> I'll take a shot in the dark here. Are you the Supreme Kai from the sixth universe? Well, I guess I am. Oh, How okay, so that's that? Supreme Kai from the haircut? universe six. It's good to meet you. Come on, Goku. Right, sorry. Catch you later, okay? Bye. Knock them dead. Um, excuse me, but are you actually friends with him? With that mortal? <laughs> yes. <laughs> We've been through a lot together. It's a long story. Oh, who are these? Okay, wait, are these the opponents of Goku? So they are here? So that's the other team, huh? Who's that kid? Uh, that looks like a oh, robot. Wait, wait, wait. Isn't that cheating? Damn, these people look tough. You never underestimate these look like this guy, bro. This guy got like that. I don't know, that strong alien vibe. And then this dude, I don't know who. Uh, Looks like a robot, isn't that cheating? But I don't know, maybe he's some kind of robot like person. Coco, look, huh? Ah! Whoa, that looks like Frieza. I guess their universe has one Whoa. too. They got their own Frieza. Okay, wait, this is gonna be tough. And that bear guy looks pretty tough. <laughs> Winnie the Pooh. All right, and that's like a weird, that's a Saiyan. It looks like a Saiyan. Sorry. This may seem like a strange question, but are the two of you Saiyans? Huh? Well, yeah, how'd you know that? I see. So there were Saiyans in your universe as well? The guy's Still a Saiyan. Are. I could tell and from I the hair. Because I am one. You're kidding me! You're a Saiyan too? Wait, can he go Super Saiyan? Mm. Oh, I'm Damn, very curious like about this. did someone else do it? What do you mean a tail? Actually, the clothes you're wearing do look familiar. The Saiyans in our universe dressed that way in the old days before Frieza enslaved us. Frieza, is that a person? Sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never heard that name before. Oh, but he has. Sounds like our history is different, like the two Earths. I feel like the Let's other Frieza has heard because he was smiling. What's the name of the planet your Saiyans call home? Planet Sadala, of course. Planet Sadala? Sadala? You're telling me that in your universe it still exists? Uh, yeah, you mean it doesn't in yours? That's right. What we call our Yeah, Earth so there's a lot of differences. Civil War. After its decimation, we conquered another planet and called it Vegeta. Wait a minute, what do you mean you conquered it? Like you took it from another civilization? Yes, that's what conquering means. Don't tell me you have a problem with that. Your Saiyans are warriors, are they not? Well, yeah, we're warriors, but we don't take what doesn't belong to us. Other races oh, they're like us to fight injustice, not created ourselves. They're like wow, the hero Saiyans. Saiyans. sound like nice people. They're nice. They're like totally different. Boys, <laughs> do you mind? Huh? We do have a written exam to get to. I hate exams. Let's go. Written we exam. Time, I'd like to hear more about your planet, Sadala. Uh, There's no need to look nervous. Not gonna lie, the, the Saiyans from Universe past, Seven look way anymore. cooler and stronger. Well, in that case, you got it. I'd be glad to. Of course, I won't show you any mercy in the ring. Oh yeah? Neither will I. <laughs> what you see before you are simple questions designed to ensure you possess the most basic degree of intelligence. Look how they're <laughs> to complete the test. Even the robot seems to be chilling. Oh wait. wait, wait. 
Oh, he's struggling. Okay, I can do this. Is it so that hard? Kate goes to the store and buys 13 breads, or uh, 13 loaves of breads, whatever. But on the way back from the store, he runs into three friends and gives them all two loaves It's each. simple math. He's obviously a nice guy. No reading out loud or you will not pass. <laughs> I didn't expect them to go straight to a written to test. Quietly. Ah, what do you mean we're down to four? We haven't even started fighting yet. We couldn't do anything about it. Once Boo falls asleep, there's no waking him no. up. No. Trust me, we've gone through this before. Boo just ruined it. <laughs> I told you he wasn't a good choice for our team, but you wouldn't listen, would you? Don't blame me. You're the one that suggested the stupid test. <laughs> That's enough! It just means you're responsible for an extra opponent now. Lord Beerus? What do you want? I'm sorry, but we have to decide the order of our contestants now. <laughs> I guess it's a 4v5. What can you do about it when Boo's asleep? Fine. Monaka fights last. Use rock, paper, scissors to decide the rest. That works for me. One, right. two, three. One. Ladies and gentlemen. First fight starting up. Let's go. Thank you for your incredible patience. The 6th and 7th Universes Invitational, the Tournament of Destroyers, will now begin. So hold on to your hats and get ready for the show. Oh, this is now, so exciting. The singing of the joint Universal Anthem. Uh, oh, boy, this should be amazing. What? What is that? Universal Anthem? Is it gonna sing? Oh, I can kind of see in the back, uh... Goku vs... Ah, uh, it's kind of hidden. Damn, we'll see, we'll see who's gonna fight. Was that it? Uh, <laughs> that was beautiful. Thank you. <laughs> that was beautiful. And hey, that's better so we can get into the fights. Will begin. Let's see who we've got from the sixth universe. Oh, Goku's versing Winnie the Pooh. Okay. And representing universe number seven. Contestant Goku. Let's go. That's the first fight. Goku's fighting first. <laughs> nah, Goku should have this easily. What's Winnie the Pooh gonna do? Hopefully he's not strong out of nowhere. Goku in the first match. That's quite a start. Not holding anything back. Give him hell, Goku! Give him hell, go straight into Super Saiyan Blue, don't hold back at all. But that's not Goku's personality, that's the thing. He has to test out his strength, he's not gonna go all out first. Let's go! Ding! Piece of shit.